I am here for the cash mob. I, I get to spend $20 somewhere and I don't know where and I'm so excited I can hardly stand it. Excellent. And you brought this guy. Yes. Yes. He usually controls my spending very much. Yeah. Somebody's got to. I know. <laughs> but this I know. is local money, so it's good money. Newsom and I'm with W.J. Wheeler Insurance in South Paris and Bethel and we're very pleased to uh, bring you the first Western Maine cash mob. Um, the first thing that I want you to do is to reach into your pocket and pull out your $20 bill and hold it up. So. Thank you, President Jackson. <laughs> so the, the big secret is about to be revealed. Tonight's cash mob destination is Books and Things on Main Street. Now, there's another secret. I'm not going to tell you this part yet, which is where the after mob is. OK? You get to find out where the after mob party is at the checkout at Books and Things. <laughs> so no freeloaders, let's be clear, okay? So I just want to do a little community pride plug right now and say that this is the fourth or fifth cash mob that's been done in Maine to date that we're aware of. Uh, Portland, York County, um, Lewiston, Auburn. And this is by far the biggest one that's happened. Yeah! Time you go down to Portland or something, strut a little bit more than you usually do. Okay? All right, so we are walking. <laughs> Give me the money! Give me the money! W.J. Wheeler Insurance is a locally owned business and we're very committed to uh, supporting other local businesses like Books and Things and Ari's Pizza. Um, you know, and the cash mob idea, Tim came up with that, that's been kind of going around the country and we were very excited to do one here. Um, and we were confident that we would be able to turn out, you know, more people than any other cash mob in Maine has, has done and we've done that clearly. Uh, so that's very exciting. Later we'll have a tally of how much money got spent in here between 6 and 8 o'clock tonight um, and that'll be exciting to see and it's just great to see everybody fired up about it and having a good time together um, and you know the things that we were hoping obviously would be to drop a bunch of cash on a couple local businesses and have people get together and enjoy a summer evening on Main Street in Norway incredibly excited about how this is going. It's really, really awesome. Thanks for coming, everybody.
I'm so glad it's not raining. Because it's nice to be outside. Um, so, I, if you didn't hear the rumor, we were sort of hoping for 50. Um, the unofficial head count for tonight is 135. And haven't already been thanked. Of course, Oxford Federal Credit Union um, for sponsoring dinner tonight and helping us out a lot with getting the event off the ground. Um, ZZ Vlon designed our logo and posters for us, and we really like them. Um, it, you can ask me later about why there's a fish on there. And um, Park Street Press in South Paris for printing uh, the big signs for us. Um, Oxford Hills Chamber of Commerce, Norway Downtown, and the Norway Business Association for helping us promote the event. Very happy to partner with them. And last but not least, Steve Galvin for coming out and putting the big camera on his back. Thank you, Thank you Steve. Another great asset of our community. So, Erica! So, thank you everybody, and if you didn't cash out, please do that soon. Good night, everyone. This was an amazing event. We have such fabulous support from this community. Um, I just can't even begin to thank W.J. Wheeler and all the people who participated. This was just way beyond anything I could have imagined.